Hey everyone, I'm Jessica with Hackers Reviews and this is Starbucks and this is our IMM this week. I got a lot, um, quite a bit actually, so I'm just going to try not to ramble too much um, and see where Starbucks is going to go because he's been jumpy but he seems to be pretty calm right now. Um, first book I got uh, is Torn by Amanda Hawking. Um, I read Switched. If you haven't tried this series, it's pretty good. Um, it's not one of my absolute favorites, but it's still a really good read. It's a new twist on some old stories, so it's really good. This is the second one. The first one is Switched, so um, I'm kind of excited to read this one. Um, the next one I got is Fairy Tales and Nightmares by Melissa Marr. I'm actually really excited to read this. I've heard lots of good things about it, and um, so I'm really excited about that one. And then the next one I've actually wanted to get for a while, but I never really got around to it, is The Iron Witch by Karen Mahoney. Um, I'm a big fan of all the Deadline Dames. If you haven't checked out their website, check out www.deadlinedames.com or they're on Twitter and Facebook. It's um, They're really cool. Some of my favorite authors are in there. You've got Carrie Arthur, Rinda Elliott, Rachel Vincent, Karen Mahoney, um, Lilith St. Crow. Actually, yeah, Lilith St. Crow's in there too. But um, I'm really excited. This has been compared to some, uh, the Iron Face series by Julie Kagawa. So I'm really actually excited to try this one out. Um, so that one's another one that I'm really excited. I just received um, this book, Wednesday, which is Spellbound by Rachel Hawkins. It's the last in a series. Um, and as you can see, I've already read it and made my notes of where I like my favorite parts and my favorite quotes. But um, it's a, they're all really good books. Um, they're kind of one of my favorites because Sophie, who is the main character, is just such an awesome character. And she's so snarky and has such a great sense of humor. This will actually keep you laughing a lot. So um, I'm really excited. Um, I finished it. My review should be coming up in a couple weeks. But um, if you want to trade or if you want to borrow, just hit me up and I'll loan it to you. The next one, um, I actually bought in ebooks, but um, I actually received Dark House by Karina Hall, and um, she asked me to read it and be part of a cover reveal for her fifth book on Demon Wings. So, of course, I wanted to read the series before I did the cover reveal because I've heard nothing but great things about Karina's work from my friend Andrea and from my friend Matt, and um, so I bought Dark House and then. I just couldn't stop, so I bought every single one in the series, and I read every single one in the entire week. So next week on my blog is probably going to be an experiment in terror takeover, because I'll be having all the reviews and everything going on, because that series is just so awesome. It's one of my favorites, and I'm so excited. And Karina is one of the nicest people in the entire world. So I'm really excited to uh, put those reviews up next week. And then... um. Hold on, he's getting it. It's okay. It's okay. Um, for review, I actually received Angel Eyes by Shannon Dittmore. I'm actually on the blog tour. If you want to go on my blog, I have the dates on there. And so I'm excited to read that. That'll be my first blog tour I've ever done. So I'm really excited about it. Um, I got Girl in a Clockwork Color from by uh, Katie Cross. And um, I've heard really good uh, reviews about the girl in the steel corset, so I'm really excited to read those. They sound really interesting. And then I got um, Endure by Carrie Jones Need. And um, so I'm excited to read that one. Another one I purchased actually was like 99 cents on uh, Amazon is Scorch Skies by uh, Samantha Young. And I've heard really good series, uh, really good things about Samantha Young's work, so I'm really like excited to read hers. And then one of um, <laughs> another one that I actually got from NetGalley because I'm a member on NetGalley is Ninja vs. Pirates featuring zombies by James Marshall. So I'm really excited to kind of find out what that is because ninjas and zombies and pirates, oh my, it sounds like a great uh, read. So I'm really kind of excited to read that one. But um, that's all the books I got. But um, I follow uh, Susan Lazier. She's an author. She's a YA author on Twitter. And she tweeted one day that um, the next people that got her to a certain amount of uh, 
followers get stickers and get a little bit of swag. So I tweeted and I won some stuff. So I got a couple of stickers from her book called Innocent Darkness. These actually look pretty cool. Um, I don't know if they can focus right there. I got those stickers and then I got two stickers that say it's okay to read YA. They're really adorable. And then I got a signed bookmark that looks really pretty. So I'm really excited and um, it's, it looks like an interesting book. So I might just have to pick that up just because of the cover. But, um, <laughs> sorry, Starbucks is wanting to go exploring. But, um, anyways, uh, that's all I had for in my mailbox this week. Uh, thanks for tuning in. I hope to see you around on the Twitter sphere. And, um, I'll see you next week. Say bye, Starbucks. Have a good night, guys.